Hello everybody and welcome to the Origins LEGO show in today's video we got a few little treats here we got a few little uh, surprises actually to reveal we have a new minifigure that I would like to display to you it was a minifigure that I was gifted to by my girlfriend actually it's a fantastic minifigure one for the older fans of LEGO and uh, speaking of older fans of LEGO I've also got a very unique minifigure but he's not too mini actually he's quite a lot bigger than the other minifigures I have. So, speaking of adult Lego, today we have these two minifigures here. We have Deadpool on the left and Rick Grimes on the right from The Walking Dead. Look at that, guys. That is pretty damn cool, isn't it? It's a, it's like a human Lego combine thing. Like his hands and body are really small and his legs are dead tiny, but his head's like enormous. So I think this is like the design, uh, it's the McFarlane blind bags, and I'm going to try and look to invest in purchasing a few more of these on the internet. I got Rick in my blind bag, so I was pretty happy to get Rick. But he's a pretty cool character, he looks really cool, he looks quite detailed, and um, I can try and get my camera to focus on him. There we go, look at that, he's got a pretty damn cool sort of look to him, he's aesthetically pleasing, he's got a cool little Lego block to stand on there, and he's a pretty cool minifigure. I'm moving on to the left. Deadpool, look at that guys and girls, that is a fantastic Deadpool minifigure, swords included by the way, I'm also going to show you all an amazing Lego website known as Brick Arms, where you can purchase replica real life guns in Lego for your minifigures, so say if you've got any soldiers, say if you've got Deadpool here, I know he has two Desert Eagles, so I'm going to show you the process of buying some of uh, Brick Arms' products in another video of course. And uh, yeah, I really like this Deadpool minifigure. I couldn't find one on Amazon and uh, I was really happy I found him. Uh, my girlfriend actually got him me as a gift as well as Rick over here. So shout out to the girlfriend, Helen, for being a legend and getting me these awesome figures to add to my collection. I'm going to try and make up of a huge collection right now from the beginning of summer. So I think I started my collection in June. And I'm going to see what it's like on December 25th. So it's going to be like a long running minifigures thing where I show you the additions and what I've got and we'll see how many I have by the end of Christmas day so yeah there we go some new characters to add to my my collection Deadpool and Rick Grimes pretty cool pretty cool now I also got a little gift from a different lady in my life my mother she went shopping and she got me this Lego Marvel's um, superheroes collection we have Loki and Thor but these Loki and Thors are driving little cars and they're little vehicles and they got little items in their hands and stuff. And I was wondering, what, why is it such a small set? It's quite a small set, but then when you notice at the bottom, it's from the Lego Marvel Mighty Micros market. And apparently, as we see on the back here of the box, there is actually a few different little ones. You got a Captain America, I think there's a Captain America and Star Lord one or something like that. I don't know. Actually, no, I think that's Nebula and Star Lord. Actually, you got Loki and Thor, Star Lord and Nebula, and then you got uh, what's that? Scarlet Spider and Sandman. So there we go. So that's what we got. They look like this. They're like a tiny little mini little mini figure. So they got a little mini figure legs going on here, little tiny legs. But you can obviously adjust them. So say if you wanted them to be a fully fledged mini figure, you could add some legs. So if I found some green or yellow legs, I can add them to Loki. I might have to opt for a black pair today. But I have my second custom Captain America figure, which is an old Captain America body uh, with a random minifigure's head and hair. But he's got the blue legs here, and I think we're going to opt to use his blue legs on Thor to make him from a micro figure to a, a standing up tall figure. Because I don't have a Thor, and I also don't have a current Loki, so we're going to use this custom minifigure that I made. It's like Viking dude. And then we're going to use his black legs for Loki's legs. So we're going to do that. I'm also going to build a little set. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to open all the pieces out in front of me. We're going to turn the camera around just so you can enjoy me uh, building it. And pretty much I'm just going to show you a sped up version of me building this Lego set. So let's flip the camera around now. Okay guys, so we got the Lego figures here. Look at this. Oh, very cool. Do some tapping on the box. There you go. And I will pick up with you guys once I have built Thor's car. So yeah, I'll see you in three two, one, let's see Thor. Pretty much I've built everything. This is the end result. These two pretty cool, unique looking little cars here, symbolizing Loki with the horn and the green and gold, gold and blue. 
some wings for Thor. I think these are new pieces. I've not really seen these wing pieces before. I've also never seen these horns before. So two pretty nifty cool little cars uh, for the little minifigures to stand up into. Also, I didn't like the idea of Loki's stuff, so I kind of uh, did some of my own pieces on top of that and kind of built it to look a bit more, I don't know, menacing, I guess. Also, found two really cool legs, kind of got like a battle pair of legs for Thor, with some black and red and just some basic brown, sandy coloured for Loki. This is what little Thor looks like, this cool little body, I've not seen this body before, and this little face is unique as well, and there's a um, Mjolnir, the hammer, is actually a smaller mould than the original ha hammer. So that's pretty cool as well as his cape being a little bit smaller, which I didn't mind actually. Loki looks pretty funny as a little tiny dude. Helmet is the same size as the original Loki helmet. So um, just a different face print, body print, and body. So that's pretty much my review of this mini little set. I thought it was pretty cool. Don't know how much mum paid for it, but um, she found it in WH Miss. So if you want to find one of these little sets, go pick them up for yourselves. Go and have a build of them. It took me about... I'd say about 5 minutes, 10 minutes to build. So I highly recommend it if you're a young learner and you're learning to build new little mini, mini builds. Uh, get a few of them, practice with them, and then once you feel confident, get a big set and build it for yourself. So yeah, if you like this video, leave a like, comment down below, subscribe if you're new, share this with a friend who likes Lego, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.